In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a firmware update on your Fritzbox 7530. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is log into the Fritzbox interface or the GUI. Now, the way you're going to do that is you're going to go to HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash 192.168.178.1 and then you're going to be asked to use your username and password once you've logged in you'll be greeted with this interface i will run through how to do that in another video if you're unsure once you're in the interface you can see up here it says fritzbox 7.13 update available so to update it you're going to want to go down to system which is here and then you want to go to update and as you can see it says fritzbox os is operate is the operating system for the fritzbox fritzbox os 7.13 in the bottom right hand corner it says find new fritzbox os you click on that there we go found a new fritz os for your fritzbox and that's version 7.20 so you've got a list of things that it's going to give you an update, quite a lot of really good things. You'll find that sometimes it's security, sometimes it's just enhanced features. Um, but what you're going to want to do is click update. As you can see here, you can now start the, up you can start the update now. All connections will be interrupted briefly in the process. The Fritzbox will restart after the update. So if you just click start update, and it will go through this process. And that's just a case of waiting for it to, uh, for it to run through and, and update. As you can see, the screen has now changed. This is the second part of the update, uh, and what it's doing is actually rebooting the router. So the interface has changed because obviously you've no longer got access to that. Um, and this is just sort of like a holding screen it gives you while it updates. It is just a case of being patient and waiting for it to boot up. If you've got the router in sort of eye line while you're doing this, uh, you will be able to see the lights go through its stages um, as, it, as it reboots and as it updates. And you're just waiting for all those lights to come back on solid again. Uh, but once you've worked your way through that, you'll then be greeted with a login screen. Then you've got the login, obviously admin again, and then you'll be greeted with this. So it says update successful, your new Fritz box or Fritz OS version successfully installed. With the update, Fritz OS 7.20, certain settings are changed, which you should be aware of. Uh, the next step, you can edit this directly. So if we click next, Fritz box updates notify me about any new versions of Fritzbox. So, so yeah, obviously, so that we don't miss it, so that we can make sure we're up to date, you want to make sure you're notified. So click OK. And then there we go. We're back to the beginning. Uh, so get to know your function of your Fritzbox. So language can be selected from user interface, uh, state of the art Wi-Fi security with WPA3. So there are a couple of things that have come through the update, which is obviously great. For this video, I'm not going to go through that, so I'm just going to close that off. But there we go. And as you can see here, it now says Fritz OS 7.20 version update. And that is how you update the firmware on your Fritzbox 7530. If you found this video helpful, please like it down below. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot more tutorials or walkthroughs on Fritzboxes, not just the 7530. I'll do the 3490 and I'll do other types of uh, routers and Wi-Fi boosters as well. So if you, want to, if you want to keep an eye on them or you want to keep up to date with them, do please give me a subscribe below. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video.